What's poppin'? It's your boy TSW Directory. So I'm bringing y'all a case study video real quick. Basically, I'ma just be kind of breaking down like, I guess like social media coordination and kind of just basically coordinating your photos or your photographs to flow with your whole feed, just in general. Basically kind of like a magazine or editorial, but just make your whole aesthetic flow. So we gonna start the case study with music artist Sabrina Claudio. I know some of y'all niggas is not fucking with her, but I'm just showing you simply because I got a couple of artists or music artist friends that basically ask for my help when it comes to like creative direction. And I feel like her team has done a pretty good job with her creative direction. So with this photo, as you can see, she's got the track list, picture of her by the Christmas tree, a lot of reds, teal background, nothing too crazy. Second photo, same thing basically. Red Christmas tree, red bow around her body, red cap, a lot of reds, a little bit of browns because of her skin tone and then the teal background just to make it pop. Next, you got a shot of her and I think it's either satin or like a silky dress, white background, a lot of browns, a lot of warm colors per usual. Next photo, again, you got her, a lot of whites surrounding her, her black hair to contrast with the whites, and then you got the warm lingerie on her body. Next, you got another photo, basically with whites around her. You got blacks behind her, and she's got on black, so it's pretty much just whites, blacks, and browns in this shot, and same for this shot. So as you can see on her feed, a lot of the shots have either white or black surrounding her as she's the subject. And mostly, you know, like warm or vibrant colors. So with the lingerie and then you got the warm lipstick. As you can see, just warm tones. And then also, a lot of whites and neutral backgrounds. Nothing too crazy. That's pretty much how her whole aesthetic is, and it's like that throughout her whole feed. So, I mean, it's pretty simple. Nothing too crazy. It takes a lot of work, you know, putting together the outfits with the warm tones that contrast well with her skin tone, while also taking the photos to where they all have a lot of whites either behind her or blacks behind her. Next, we're gonna start with the colors. As you can see here, with my Pantone setup, it just shows pretty much warm, vibrant colors. Nothing too shabby. Only thing that really pops is the teal and the reds, but a lot of warm tones with neutrals. Next, we're gonna start with Orion Carlotto. I know it's a bunch of y'all that I know probably follow her. Pretty dope person. You got a selfie of her. Nothing but black, brown, and white. Pretty much same here. Giving off the gray academia vibe. Got the whole gray suit. White. Button down. Black hair. The hint of brown on her purse. And then the gray or concrete colored brick. Then you got this shot of the Margiela fragrance inside of a bowl. A lot of browns within this shot and a hint of green. And with this shot, same thing, whites, browns. And same here, grays, browns, and whites. And as you can see here on her Instagram feed, it's pretty much the same thing difference between her and Sabrina is she brings a lot more green and ground tones and she 
usually overshadows most of her images with neutral colors. And it's a little less contrast in most of her images. The contrast is like basically what shows the difference between the highlights or the whites and the shadows and the blacks. When you turn down the contrast on a lot of your images, it kind of just makes it to where the blacks and whites or the highlights and the shadows blend in. But as you can see, a lot of neutrals and a lot of whites on her page. So a lot of it just blends in very well together. Small hints of browns or small hints of color, but nothing too crazy. Mostly a lot of whites and neutrals. And that's pretty much up with her page. And as you can see here, I set up five of her photos together and all you see is tan, another brown, gray, green, and black. So that's pretty much it for this case study today, y'all. Um, so when you're taking photos, just be mindful of, you know, your background, your subject, the colors that come with the subject, the outfit. It just takes a lot to put it together. And then to top it off, if you want it to flow consistently or cohesively throughout your whole feed, you just have to make sure a lot of it looks similar. But yeah. That's pretty much it for the case study today, y'all. Appreciate y'all for watching.